1번. 대화를 듣고 줄리를 고르세요. Hi, Chris. Good to see you. Where's Tina? She couldn't make it. She went to see a play with her cousin. Oh, well, why don't you go and talk to Julie? She doesn't know anyone here. Julie? Which one is she? Is she the woman wearing glasses over there? No, she is the tall one in trousers. She's standing behind the table holding a glass. Oh, I'd like to meet her. Let's go. I got a D on my math test. I feel frustrated. You know, I really studied hard. Too bad. Don't be stressed too much. You will do better next time. I know. Now I feel like doing something cheerful. Mmm. My friend invited me to go canoeing in the River Thames. Oh. That sounds great. Can I go with you? Of course. I was just about to ask you to join us. Really? How can I thank you enough? My pleasure. Do you feel better now? Sure. Your invitation gets rid of my stress. 3번 다음을 듣고 무엇에 관한 설명인지 고르세요. If you have ever had trouble remembering people's names, here are some ways. The best way is to put people's names together. If your friend Bill introduced you to David, you can remember them together as Bill and David because Bill is connected to David. If Rosie was wearing a blue skirt when you met her first, it might help to remember her name as Blue Skirt Rosie. Another tip you can try is to repeat the name over and over. If you have some time while they are not talking to you, you can repeat their names in your mind. In these ways, you won't forget precious names. 4번 대화를 듣고 남자가 여자를 위해 할 일을 고르세요. I'm excited. I heard that this show is one of the four best musicals. Yes, it was difficult to get tickets. Thank you. Well, who was the director? Wait, let me see the brochure. Andrew! Oh, it's him. All his works are great. By the way, I cannot see the stage. The man in front of me is too tall. He blocks my view. Why not change our seats? Thank you. 5번. 대화를 듣고 남자가 구입할 물건에 해당하지 않는 것을 고르세요. Honey, are you going to the store? Yeah, I'm going to buy some apples. Why? We're almost out of orange juice. Could you pick up a bottle? Sure. Anything else? If you pick up a jar of tomato sauce, I'll make spaghetti tonight. Great. Do we have noodles for spaghetti? Oops. We ate up all of them last time. How about milk? We have lots of milk. 6번. 다음을 듣고 남자가 하는 말의 목적으로 가장 적절한 것을 고르세요. It's not too late to make plans for New Year's Eve. North Park Hotel is now offering a special New Year's package. For the low price of just $250, you will receive two tickets to the New Year's Ball in the North Park Tower, a luxury suite for one night, and complimentary brunch at North Park's five-star buffet restaurant, plus a small souvenir. Call now and make an unforgettable New Year. 
7번. 대화를 듣고 남자가 지불한 금액을 고르세요. I'd like to send this package by express mail. Certainly, sir. But this is an oversized item. You should pay an extra charge. That's fine. How much is the extra charge? Ten dollars. So your total comes to forty dollars. Would you like to have it insured? Yes, I would. How much is the insurance? It's ten percent of the total. Good. Here is fifty dollars. Thank you. Here is the change. Six dollars and the receipt. 8번. 대화를 듣고 두 사람이 대화하고 있는 장소를 고르세요. Gee, what's going to happen? Don't worry. Everything is okay. Then why did the captain tell us to fasten our seatbelts? You don't have to worry. It's just because of strong wind. I know you are just trying to make me feel better. No, I'm serious. Please, take a deep breath and relax. Would you like to have something to drink? No, thanks. Well, then, when can I take off my seatbelt? You can take it off as soon as we get out of the turbulence and the safety sign goes off. 9번. 대화를 듣고 부모가 피터에게 시키려고 하는 일을 고르세요. Would you do me a favor? I hope it's not difficult. No, it isn't. It's about my friend Sandra and her dog. What is it? Sandra's leaving for Paris to visit her grandmother in a week, so she wonders if her dog can stay in our place. Well, the owner of the house probably wouldn't allow us to keep a dog. But the dog is just a little puppy. Our son Peter will love to take care of him. Um, I don't want to make any trouble, and I dislike noisy barking. Honey, I think this is a good chance to teach Peter responsibility. Why don't we let Peter walk him every morning? Responsibility? Okay, as long as Peter does his job well. 10번. 대화를 듣고 두 사람의 관계로 가장 적절한 것을 고르세요. How may I help you? It's my MP3 player. What's wrong with it? I dropped it on the way to the library. It stopped working. Let me take a look at it. It doesn't look serious. Can you fix it right away? I have an important listening test tomorrow. You know, I have to practice listening with this MP3 player. Don't worry. I can repair it in two hours. Leave your phone number at the desk. Our staff will call you as soon as I fix it. <sighs> you saved me. Thank you so much. 11번 대화를 듣고 남자가 어제 하지 않은 일을 고르세요. Hi, Jenny. Guess what? It was great yesterday. Was it? You know Jasmine? Finally, I went out with her. Really? Congratulations! What did you do? I went to an amusement park with her and rode a roller coaster and a merry-go-round. And I took many pictures with her. Fantastic! That's not the end. We had dinner together at a fancy restaurant. It was great. Wow, you had a nice day. 12번 대화를 듣고 이번 가을에 유행하게 될 블라우스의 장식이 아닌 것을 고르세요. Susan, what are you reading? Hey, look at these pictures. They are the blouses of this autumn collection. What kind of blouses are expected to be popular? 
Blouses with fancy decorations are this autumn's trend. Such as what? The ones with brooches or beads around the neck. Aha, those kinds. What about the ones with ribbons? They will be popular too. By the way, would your blouse with flowers you bought last year be okay for this year? It's already out of date. I'd rather buy a new one with lace. That will be a trend too. What?